but then kind of gave it up for Diddy. So he's making a run too. We got game one, the Percy Bayo versus Sickles Wario. Percy's still rocking the karma tag. Even his, his, his Twitter handle even is Percy's Karma. And I don't actually know what it means. Wow, quick 78% busting out here from Percy. Just heel sliding right into Sickle. Sickle not, not yet adapting to, uh, to deal with it. You can just grab. You can also up smash out of shield or down smash out of shield or something like that. Ooh, didn't find the bear there. All right, Sickle setting up some of this bike shenanigans. Sickle's a very, very, very good Wario, which means that he knows his WAF setups really well. All right, back air just waits that out, and that's actually going to kill Sickle. So Sickle drops his first dock, 55 seconds in, only doing 21% to Percy. He's got a little bit of a, of a hill to climb here. All right, Percy just making use of that platform, making sure Sickle knows that he cannot approach. What's up, Jake? <laughs> okay, we got some Nair combos. Unfortunately, it's a little too early for him to be busting out his waft because it's only, I mean, Ben has it 69%, so maybe now, but he doesn't have full waft yet. He's only sitting at half. The, the general rule of thumb with waft is it's usually like 55 seconds half waft, 150 is full waft. So he should be getting it here in 10 seconds. But he's probably going to be looking to take the stock and then maybe cheese out a, an early percent kill the second stock with Waft. Gets that forward tilt. Sickle's been adjusting really, really well to uh, the way that Percy's been trying to box him out with aerials. That mouse not feeding anybody today. Definitely not Sickle. Just tosses the bike off. Gets a little damage. Forward throw is going to kill Percy. 145. Wario has actually a couple kill throws, but none of them kill all that early. All right, trying to get that Nair. He wants a Nair or he wants a landing up air if he's going to get that waft here. If he does rising Nair like that on shield, it's mostly just like a shield pressure tool and a combo tool, not really a waft tool. All right, gets a, Percy gets a back air. All right, gets a forward throw, not gonna kill yet. Wario isn't the heaviest, but he's still decently heavy. They have a very strong ledge trapper, but Sickle's able to navigate it, gets a grab, Percy's off stage. Trying to get that down tilt trip. All right, forward throw from Sickle. Sickles back off stage. Wario just lives from everywhere, though. That Nair is actually going to take it. 180. Sickle living a very, very long time, but not able to turn that into a Rage Waft. Very good adaptations from him. Started to, to scout out the way that Percy was approaching him and putting pressure on him. And kind of navigated around the way that Percy tried to camp him out. So he did really, really well coming back from that early hole, but it just wasn't quite enough. So we're going to try to figure out how he wants to get this together. So part of it is Battlefield. I know that Wario does, has a couple little platform combos, and then also Bike on platform means that he gets a little bit larger of an effective area for Waft, just because of the way the hit lag works. All right, quick chomp. We're not finding anything. Okay, but he's, he's punishing that heel slide with dash attack now. Good adaptation. Another chomp. Percy get the ladder, he does. Sickle dying 30 seconds into a quick ladder for Percy. Percy got the combo started on that platform, and so Sickle's got to figure out what to do now. He's actually in less of a hole than he was in the first game, and he still almost brought it all the way back. So definitely not out of this yet. All right, he'll slide on shield. Sickle punishes with a forward tilt. But he gets witch timed just for the down tilt. Great tech from Sickle, avoiding the uh, ABK follow-up after the back air. All right, that forward tilt's not going to be quick enough to punish. Second hit of heel slide on shield. Percy gets a spot dodge there. 
All right, tosses the bike up. Of course, he just wants that. I mean, it's similar to uh, like Rob's gyro or a banana in that if you grab it, it's effectively yours to control and yours to use as a stage hazard. Of course, Warrior gets his weird like waft set up either way. Okay, and that waft is going to punish the heel slide. Percy getting a little greedy with some of these heel slides here. Gets a heel slide that time though. Catches Sickle being a little bit too aggressive. Gets laddered but isn't able to find the aerial finisher. Just the first hit of down air. All right, heel slide on shield. Back air with bat within. Four throws, not gonna kill. It's Battlefield, but also Wario Savvy is only at 130. That was actually really, really smart. Just uh, heel slid under the, the item throw so that he could get his own combo started. Oh, okay. Bat within the back air. That's not gonna be enough. That's really, really hard to DI correctly because you want to SDI out, but you don't want to DI out. Because otherwise you'll die a little earlier than you want, and that is probably a little earlier than Sickle wanted. Percy following all the way down there with the back air, drops on back air, and Percy takes it 